Hello guys, uh, this is the first video of a series I'm showing you guys how to create a web application and deploy it uh, on uh, a server, a website. So uh, what are we building? This is a an expand tracker app. So it will help you uh, create wallets and also track the uh, expenses. Like you know, money in and out uh, in your daily. So probably you have uh, you know what you're spending on, and uh, probably have uh, better management of the money. That is the purpose of this app. So let me show you how it works. So I'm currently logged into this app. So I need to log out first, just to show you. Uh, we can log in and log out. So if I click on go to wallets here, and there's a login screen. And I log in, click on continue. Now I'm inside the wallets. So currently I have two wallets here. And you can create as many wallets as you want. Let me create another one. My private wallet. Okay, description. Uh, of course, private wallet. Okay. So for example, I want to track some uh, expenses uh, regard, uh, not regarding to a family or other wallet. And I 200 probably. And create wallet. And you see that it is here. Click on view. And here you can add and view your transactions. So let's uh, create a transaction. So I don't know why. Um, Video games, all right? Okay, so yeah, doesn't need a description. Forty-five dollar, probably games. Okay, and of course, it is a withdraw. You have withdraw and deposit. Withdraw is money going out of the wallet. So now we have uh, this transaction here, and you can create a transaction and attach an image to that. For example. An image of a bill, so I don't know. Buy books. Uh, buy books. I don't know. There's three books, and of course we create a file to upload. Uh, select the file. So I select this screenshot here, and you see that this loading bar, loading spinner, the image is being uploaded to S3. So click on create and you see that the preview is here. So that is pretty much uh, what we're building. So what you will learn? You will learn how to develop this UI with Angular. Not pretty, but uh, functional. You also learn to uh, develop an API with Spring Boot. And the database we use is MongoDB. And you will also learn how to um, communicate with uh, S3 to store your files, just like this case, which um, I store the image here. And finally, uh, you learn how to deploy this application to a domain, which uh, I'm going to buy a domain and uh, deploy this app, including your API and the UI using Docker and Jenkins. So every time you uh, commit, to the main branch or the master branch, then the uh, application will be deployed uh, automatically. So that is um, quite a lot to to learn. And uh, I also uh, have the repository here. So I pushed everything here. This is for the UI, and this is for the API. And also, I have the blog series. If you prefer uh, prefer reading to watching video, then the, the blog series here. Yes, everything, every links will be included in the description. And finally, this UI uh, is from this template. It's free. So thank you, Start with Strap, for providing this one for free. So for personal use. Okay. And that's it. I hope uh, you get excited 
with uh, this app and um, in the next I guess 8 or 10 videos we are going to learn how to develop this step by step so thank you for watching and I see you in the next video